everybody, it's Jojo Kwan Plans and I'm here with another plan with me in my vertical planner from the 8th of August to the 14th of August using this really gorgeous gold foil spread from Olive Planner Co. It's a New Year's spread, however, I'm repurposing um, this kit for a better cost. And as usual, I've pulled aside stickers into my reusable Jadin Paper Co. sticker book. And the pen that I'll be using for this spread is my Pilot G2 pen in 0.38. Let's move on to the base of the spread and I'm really excited to tell you that this spread is actually for my birthday week. So it's super exciting and I decided to pull in a bit more foil links from Olive Planet Co. And it was really really exciting. So stay with me as I go through the base of the spread and I'll see you in a little bit. Welcome back everybody, I hope you enjoyed the base of the spread and as we move into the second week of August, it's really exciting because we are halfway almost um, to the end of 2022 and that would mean preparing for new planners which is really really exciting so I can't wait to show you my new planner lineup. I'm pretty sure I said about this like in the last plan with me but I'm really excited to show you how I'll be changing up my planning system in a little bit for 2023. So to start off Monday, I'm just using a fiery Jadin Paper Co. sticker with a star shine in the fire because it was a full day of school from 9am to 6pm after a whole week of a pre-module class. After that, I had kimchi fried rice for lunch with a sticker from Ohana Story. Followed by that, it was the review of the grouping that my teacher had for us and I was pretty satisfied with it so I was pretty happy and now that it is the fifth week we are working really well together and we are one week away from one of the biggest presentation. After that I had a long train ride to my friend's place because we had a gathering there. It was um it was going to be National Day the next day. So um, it was a holiday on Tuesday and we managed to have a gathering on the Monday and I was really, really touched because they got us a cake, um, my sister and I, because we both have our birthdays in August. So it was a really great night, although it was a super long day, but I was really, really happy and contented. Now moving on to Tuesday, I started the morning by using a sticker to mark that I had a very good sleep last night and I managed to sleep in today. It was a day that was um, really tiring because I had little drink the night before so it was a good rest and also I jumped out of bed to rush an assignment. I was pretty sure I was like not forgetting it because it was a national day post. So I managed to get it all done and I went over to my boyfriend's place for a last minute lunch which was really really exciting. I also managed to get some um, errands done. What's it called? Errands. I managed to touch up my nails, um, edit like my plan with me, collect some stuff from town, 
cut some printables and also ended the night with a workout. So it was a really productive Tuesday and I was just going around by myself and yeah, I enjoyed a really good Tuesday for myself. And moving on to Wednesday, which is the big day, I turn officially 22 and yeah i'm really really happy with how the year has went super thankful for all the changes that have um made me who i am today so i was actually alone for my birthday because my whole family got covid so we were unable to have dinner but on that day itself i still had to go to school so i was just using a very sad draggy bubble mon from bubble mon sticker co because I had to go to school. And after that, I had a very, very bad food coma. I used a sticker from shop with a nice because, yeah, I actually had myself a good treat for my birthday. After that, I used a sticker from Value Tuma to mark that I had a workout session done. It was really, really exciting and I'm happy that I'm back into working out now for the fifth week. And now moving on to the evening, I actually had a good time to clean my whole collection of earrings because I just had to clean them and keep it clean because they are not like hypoallergic. So to be safe, I just did some cleaning and ended the night at 10.30 with a sticker from Ohana Story. And now moving on to Wednesday, it's really um, like relaxed because I had to start the morning by registering my tutorial lessons for school. I used a sticker from Happy Dyer, followed by that, um, I went over to my Chinese doctor appointment, which was really, really frustrating because I had so many medications to take. However, these medications actually helped me to feel so much better, and it's a trip that is worth going. After that, I used a sticker from 15 Pro because I went to my mom's place. I usually go over to my mom's place after doctor to visit my family. And thankfully, um, they are actually feeling better even though they got COVID. So I managed to go over. We ordered boba with a sticker from Little Planet Papery. And it was a super duper hot day. Like I was staying at home, but I could feel the heat and the stuffy stuffiness, which was really, really troubling. After that, I went home and continued with a workout session, which was really good, and ended the night with a church session at my friend's place using a sticker from Whimsical Cat Studio. So as we can see, I am voice-overing this a bit, a little bit too fast. And yeah, I think it's totally fine. So that was all for Thursday really exciting one and then we'll move on to Friday in a little bit. To start off Friday, I used a box from the kit together with a flourish from Olive Planico and also a dim sum sticker from Wonton in a Million to mark that I had dim sum for breakfast which was really really nice. I just had to go down to the coffee shop near me to do a self pickup and that's my breakfast usually. After that I use a header from the kit to distinguish the full boxes and it actually looks really nice. I really love this kit. I am very thankful that I managed to use this for my birthday. It's really really pretty and I love it. After that um it was a pretty busy Friday. I had some reading and lecture to do and also grocery shopping. The two stickers are from Craft Trina as well as Paper K Design. Usually I do my grocery shopping when I feel like cooking and I will get groceries for the full week. So that was the first part of Friday. After that I reached home from grocery shopping and did a good workout with a dumbbell from Bubble Bear Studio and then um I think I had something on. I had I had a landscape architecture society gathering over at town and oh this was what happened. So I had the gathering. After that we went to drink at Beerenberg. No, not Beerenberg. I can't remember the name. And yes, I ended up in the hospital. Because my heart actually felt really really painful the chest was really really tight I started to feel numb and it was something that I felt probably around 
um, nine, ten months ago where I got admitted to the hospital for quite a bit. So um, I felt really embarrassed because my friends were all there and I felt really bad as well because um, I made them worry so much but everything was good. I discharged myself on Saturday morning at 7.30am and went back home to sleep for a good 5 hours because I was fully dosed on Tramadol which is a really strong uh, medication and I absolutely, absolutely hated it. And when I wake up, woke up, um, I decided to order a bowl of soup that was really heartwarming for lunch and then went for church which was a really really long ride and I felt really uncomfortable for a little bit. But I managed to relax and also went home for a planning time before going up to rest um, early with a sticker from Create with Pen. And now moving on to Sunday, I'm using a sticker from Simply Me Cage to mark that I had some sticker kits to cut. Jojo is now doing a no spend because she needs to save for a overseas trip. So I'm doing all, thing po- all things possible to just do printables and also using up the stickers that I have, which is a lot and my planner buddy Ina can vouch for me. After that, I use a shopping sticker from she- from Shop With A Nice to shop for some clothes as well as I think I did manage to get some other stuff. Then I used a Lazy Day sticker from Rila Walla Co. And also on that day, I did um, some filming of Happy Meals and also a voiceover for the last plan with me. And for dinner, I had Maki-san, which is a sushi. But because it was a really, really chunky sushi, I was super full and actually kept it, kept a little bit for supper. After that, I had a really good long shower. And because I just discharged from hospital, I couldn't do a workout. That explains why I haven't worked out for a few days. After that, I used a sticker from Hard Man and Chop Girl to mark that I had to go to bed early. And that is the end of the spread. The week of the 8th of August to the 14th of August has been absolutely amazing. Loads of me time and a lot of toxicity as well. Which is really bad because I should be looking after myself in situations like this. And I am actually looking after myself a little bit more. So thank you all for being here with me, for staying through the plan with me. I hope you enjoyed as much as I did. Meanwhile, stay safe and be happy and I see you in my next plan with me.